Following the tragic passing of bandmate Liam Payne at the age of 31, Lewis Tomlinson has shared a heartfelt ode to him. The One Direction member died instantaneously from severe injuries after plunging from the third story of the Casaser Hotel in Buenos Aires, Argentina, on Wednesday. Lewis expressed his shock at his friend's passing in an Instagram statement, adding that he will always be an uncle to the late singer's eight-year-old son Bear. I am so sad to be writing this, but my brother passed away yesterday. I always looked up to Liam because he was such a lovely, witty, and upbeat person. When I first met Liam, I was 18 and he was 16. I was immediately taken aback by his voice, but more significantly, as time passed, I had the opportunity to meet the loving brother I had been waiting my entire life to see. We often talked about getting back in the studio together to try and recreate the writing chemistry we had developed in the band. Liam was an amazing songwriter with a great sense of melody. For the record, I felt that Liam was the most important member of One Direction. His early life experiences, flawless pitch, charisma on stage, and writing talent. The list is endless. Liam, thank you for molding us. If you're listening, Liam, I have a message for you. Though I consider myself incredibly fortunate to have known you, I find it quite difficult to say goodbye. I'm so happy that we have become even closer since the band. Being able to talk on the phone for hours on end and remember the thousands of incredible moments we shared is a luxury I never imagined I'd have with you forever. It was not meant to be, but I would have delighted to take the stage with you once more. I want you to know that I will be Bear's uncle in the event that he needs one and that I will tell him tales about his incredible father. I wish I had the opportunity to say goodbye and express my love for you one more time. I love you, buddy. Pano is my brother my boy, and one of my dearest friends. Rest well, X. A photo of Lewis and Liam performing together in 2015 was also published on social media before One Direction announced their breakup the following year. Shortly after, Zayn Malik also used social media to post a lengthy homage, along with a cute photo of himself and Liam Asklep. Liam, he wrote, I find myself talking to you aloud in the hopes that you will hear me and I can't help but feel resentful because I feel like there should be so much more talk between us in our lives. I never had the chance to express my gratitude for helping me get through some of the hardest moments of my life. As a 17-year-old girl, you would always be there for me with a cheery grin and a good attitude, letting me know that you were my friend and that I was cherished. You were always more rational than I was, even though you were younger. You were also very opinionated, stubborn, and didn't give a damn when you told others they were wrong. I've always secretly respected you for that, even if we've had a few arguments over it. Liam, you were the most qualified person in the world when it came to music. I was a young child with no experience, and you were an established professional. I was always relieved to know that we could always count on you to know where to steer the ship next, regardless of what transpired on stage. I can't explain to you what I'd give to just give you a hug one last time say goodbye to you properly, and tell you that I loved and respected you dearly. I lost a brother when you left us. There are no words to describe or justify how I feel right now other than beyond devastated. But I will always treasure the memories I have of you. Wherever you are at this moment, I hope you are content and at peace, and that you are aware of how loved you are. I adore you, my brother. It happened after the band announced in unison that they were completely devastated by Liam's passing breaking their silence. There will be more to say when the time comes and everyone is able to, they declared. We will, however, need some time to mourn and come to terms with the loss of our beloved brother. We shall always cherish the moments we had with him. We are currently thinking about his friends, family, and fellow fans who shared our love for him. He will be sorely missed. Louis, Zane, Neil, Harry, and I all adore you, Liam. Payne, 31, may have been semi-conscious or entirely unconscious when he fell from a hotel balcony, according to information released earlier today by Argentina's prosecutor's office. Yesterday, the celebrity leaped 45 feet from the third story into the Casaser Hotel's courtyard in the capital of Argentina and was pronounced dead by emergency personnel. Numerous items that were taken from the hotel room, showing past scenarios of alcohol and drug consumption, were confirmed by detectives. It appears as the One Direction member goes back to his hotel room and then jumps from the balcony, 
saying he was off his head on drugs. According to hotel personnel, Liam Payne will forever live in our hearts and will remember him for his kind, funny, and brave soul. According to his family, who described themselves as heartbroken, before he passed away, the One Direction member was acting erratically with police called to his hotel over drugs and alcohol claims. According to the star's horrifying injuries, Maya Henry, Liam Payne's former fiance, stated that the celebrity predicted he would die early. Waliha Malik, Zayn Malik's sister, acknowledges that Liam Payne's passing has left her heartbroken and speechless. Fans who were devastated came to the hotel to place flowers and candles for Payne. Just minutes prior to his passing, Payne sent a picture to his girlfriend over Snapchat. In addition, Harry Styles wrote a devastating ode to his bandmate Liam Payne, expressing his true devastated state following his 31-year-old passing. The 30-year-old singer used Instagram to deliver an emotional message to his friend, whom he described as warm, supportive, and incredibly loving. After the band released a unified statement a few hours earlier, Liam passed away on Wednesday in Buenos Aires, Argentina, following a fall from the third floor of the Casa Sur Hotel. Both celebrities and fans sent heartfelt respects to him. I am profoundly devastated by Liam's passing, Harry tweeted, sharing a photo of Liam performing. It was an honor to be beside him when he made other people happy. It was his greatest joy. Liam had an amazing enthusiasm for life and enjoyed life to the fullest, putting his heart on his sleeve. He was really loving, kind, and encouraging. The years we had together will always rank among the most treasured ones in my memory. My dear friend, I shall always love him. Karen Jeff, Nicola and Ruth, his son Bear, and everyone else who knew and loved him as much as I did are in my thoughts and prayers. When Neil was photographed on Thursday for the first time since Payne's passing, he appeared to be inconsolable. Liam and his girlfriend Amelia Woolley went for a walk in London with the This Town hitmaker, whom they had seen performing live in Argentina just a few days before he passed away. Hotel personnel frantically dialed 911 in the moments before Payne passed away, reporting that an irate man who possibly was under the influence of narcotics or alcohol was smashing up his room. According to the BBC, hotel guests reported hearing violent noises and assumed there was construction going on in the room. Photographs from within his opulent suite have also surfaced, seemingly revealing a broken television, tin foil and white powder covering surfaces, and burned scars on the wood. Everything indicates that Payne was alone when he passed away, according to a preliminary assessment on the pop star's death. Five witness statements have been obtained by the prosecution two of whom were with Payne the night before he passed away. Before the One Direction star fell from her hotel balcony, police had been looking for the two because they had been recognized as key witnesses.